Hey everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to todayifeellike.com. Today we are over here in Washington, D.C. at the National Mall. We're about to go check out the Sculpture Garden. There's already one sculpture right behind us, right over here. So, let's go check out some other ones. Here we go. Alright, here is a giant pumpkin. I have no idea what this means, who made it, but there is a little placard over here. So let's go check that out. We'll walk right over here. It looks like it is made by uh, Ye Yeoi Kasuma. So, not exactly how to pronounce that, but it's a fiber reinforced plastic that's part of her collection. And uh, yeah, so anyways, you guys can hit pause on there, check that out. Let's go see what else we see. What is this? A warrior of Manitoban out of bronze? Alright, there you go. Dude has no legs, but apparently he can still get it in. Moving on to the next one. All right, this one is a uh, Rodin, a Augusti Rodin, Augustus Rodin. This is the the Burgers of Hallies, I believe it is. Um, but let me show you guys here. Let me show you the placard here. You guys can check that out. You can hit pause and uh, yeah, see it all you want. But there you have it. There, it's pretty cool looking. And uh, yeah, let's see what else we see here. So this piece here is called King and Queen. This is by uh, Henry Moore. He is a British artist from England, and uh, yeah, and this was actually a gift of Joseph H. Hershorn back in, uh, uh, let's see, looks like the 60s he brought this over, but yeah, this is kind of cool, so I kind of like it, it reminds me of sort of like a cool stick figure interpretation of a stick figure of some sort, so anyways, this is it, it's called King and Queen, we'll check out a couple more, and then we'll get up out of here. Alright, this is a cool one, this one is called Seated Yucatan Woman from uh, Francisco Zueninga, I believe it is, and uh, yeah, it's made out of bronze actually. So yeah, this one's pretty cool looking, I have to say. So she is seated, chilling. Looks like she probably had a uh, a full day. All right, here's another one. This one is funny to me. It's called uh, Subcommittee, and this is by an artist called Tony Craig or Craig, excuse me. Uh, he's a British dude, but if you look at it, it's a bunch of stamps. So. Uh, yeah, I guess it's called subcommittee because everybody has to get signed off on stuff. Everybody has to sign off on stuff and stamp everything. So, anyway, it's a pretty cool piece. I think it's pretty interesting. All right, this is the last one I'm going to show you guys today. And I don't know what this is called. I don't see a placard. But it reminds me of the inside of the Death Star. Oh, look, here's a placard. I see it's grown over. It's called Sphere Number 6 from Arnando Pomodoro from Italy. But I like it. It uh, it does. It looks like the, it looks like how I would imagine the Death Star looked after it got taken out. So, anyways, here it is. Pretty cool looking, and uh, yeah, I think that's it. I'm about to head on out. All right, everyone. So there you have it. That is a look at the National Sculpture Garden here in Washington D.C. It's a pretty cool place. If you guys get a chance to check it out, I'm gonna leave a link to it in the video description so you guys can see it and check it out and get more info if you like it. And. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and follow me on Facebook. And I am Larry with todayifeellike.com. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.